Good evening. The possibilities are endless and the Erie Metropolitan Transit Authority is hoping if they build it, businesses will come and help revitalize the portion of Parade Street. Tyler Gallagher joins us in the studio with the plan tonight. Tyler. Thanks, Jen. The Erie Metropolitan Transit Authority is looking to bring more businesses to Erie's east side, but there is still work to be done before any businesses can fill that space. About two years ago, the EMTA cut the ribbon on its new 18,000 square foot facility with a goal to have local businesses fill the space. This week, construction began on the facility on East 14th Street to get that space ready for businesses to move in. It's an empty shell, but it has to be constructed, it has to be built out inside. Uh, and once it's built out inside, it'll attract, it, it'll be a little more appealing to somebody coming in going, okay, now I can envision this being here, that being there. No businesses have officially rented out the space yet, but Peterson says they are in talks with potential future tenants who are interested. EMTA is working to turn all of this lower floor into retail space, but they're still not certain what businesses will fill that space. We want to have uh, maybe some type of, you know, grocer or, or deli or uh, anything uh, because this is still considered a, a food desert area. Peterson says EMTA wants to promote economic development in the area and be an asset in bettering the community. Erie's East Side Renaissance Vice President says the EMTA facility will help revitalize the Parade Street area. We just think the more the merrier. It's very exciting to have other others in the area finally see that Parade Street's an important, it's the original Main Street and it's an important part of Erie and so we're glad to be uh, one of the catalysts to make some things happen over here. He says new development on Parade Street improves the safety and security of the area, but also attracts more people to a part of Erie that gets less attention than others. What's going on downtown is great. A lot of things happening on the west side are great, but more needs to be done on the east side. And so we just took it upon ourselves to say, hey, let's start this, um, this development process. And between the EMTA facility, a new bank going up, and the efforts of the east side renaissance, eastern development is well underway. Peterson says he estimates the EMTA facility will finish its interior construction in early February of 2025. Back to you, Jen. All right, Tyler Gallagher reporting tonight. Thank you, Tyler.